<laughs> yeah, I used to always wonder why God was always referred to as he. How could anyone know if God was a male? I mean, it used to make me mad. But then I got pregnant, and then I gave birth. Whoever engineered that little plan had to be a male. <laughs> I mean, if God was a she, or at least part female, you know, like this yin-yang thing. Some of the suggested engineering would have been to make the doorway bigger, or at least stretch more. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> or, or use one of these hinged fold-out devices for easy exiting. I mean, who, who thought that passing a watermelon through a needle hole was a good idea? Not a woman. It's like that whole flattening of the boob idea. A man. I just cannot see a panel full of women scientists sitting around the table saying, oh, I know. Let's smush our breasts like a pancake between two plates of cold steel, then blast them with radiation. And the rest of the women raising their hands in victory saying, yes, let's. Oh, that's a great idea, Shirley. Do the test on me. <laughs> yes. now, I can see it now. Now correct me if, if I'm wrong. But I don't think there's a test that compresses a man's you-know-what into a piece of paper. <laughs> yeah. Uh-huh. <laughs> I can see it now, all the men doctors crossing their legs in, in objection, saying, well, that would hurt. No shit, Sherlock. <laughs> oh, oh, I, I gotta go.